to enjoy our bread and make it more tasty. You can eat it with granules, right? <laughs> also, to make your tea more refreshing, you can add a cube of sugar, right? Do you know that the granules and sugar that help in enhancing your fulfillment and satisfaction are acting as catalysts? That's so true. However, while the granules and bread are both in the solid phase, the tea and sugar are in the liquid and solid state, respectively. When they are in the same state, it can be likened to homogeneous catalysis, where the catalyst, reactant, and product are all in the same phase. And when they are in different states, it can be compared with heterogeneous catalysis, where the reactant, product, and catalyst are in different phases. Today, we have learned that homogeneous catalysis is a reaction where the catalyst, reactant, and product are in the same phase. An example is sulfur 4 oxide plus oxygen to give you sulfur 5 oxide. It uses nitrogen 2 oxide gas as a catalyst, which is also in the gaseous phase. Heterogeneous catalysis is that in which the reactant, product, and catalyst are in different phases. An example is hydrogen plus iodine to give you hydrogen iodide. It uses platinum as a catalyst and it is in a solid phase. I'm sure you enjoyed today's lesson. See you in the next one.